Hi, my name's Amy, and today we're making cinnamon roll French toast with rolled cinnamon rolls. You take a bread pan and spray it real good with cooking spray, and then I've got my cinnamon rolls, and you want them thawed really nice and soft, and you can use six to eight. I'm gonna use about eight today. I'm just gonna start placing them in my pan. If you use eight, it'll just give you a bigger loaf of bread. So I've got eight in here, and then you're just gonna pinch them together and squish them together, and if you do this, just right down in your pan, then you won't get air pockets or air bubbles when you're slicing for your French toast. And your bread needs to rise till about doubled in size, and then you'll bake at 350 degrees for about 25 to 30 minutes. So I'm gonna set this aside to rise, and I've already baked a loaf, and the great thing about it is that you can slice it as thin or as thick as you want for your French toast. Now spray your griddle with some nonstick cooking spray, and I keep mine at about 350 degrees, and then you just take your pieces and dip both sides into your egg, and then right in your grill. Then once your French toast is cooked, you can serve it with our yummy caramel syrup, even some sliced strawberries. If you'd like the complete recipe, visit RhodesBread.com. Thanks for baking with Rhodes.